Where shall we go? What shall we choose? Whatever we do, there's no time to lose. Let's turn the big spinner and I'll say the rhyme. What's gonna happen today on Showtime? So today on Create Time, we are here at the Craft Pottery and we're going to go and meet Leah and she's going to show us the whole pottery process. We're going to get messy, maybe make a pot. What do you think, Luther? That's what I thought too. Let's go. So this is the lovely Leah who's got us aproned up. Luther's bashing some equipment already. Hi, Luther. And Leah, what are we going to be doing today then? We are going to be making pots. So first of all, we need to prepare the clay. So I'm going to wedge it up and make sure there's no air bubbles inside. Because if there is, it'll explode in the kiln. And we don't want right. that. No explosions, Luther. So no air bubbles. If you take a ball of clay, you can pat it and we'll just get some of the air out. Do you want one, Luther? You want to pat it? <laughs> you want to pat it? That's it. Hold it. That's it now. Look. <laughs> don't eat it, remember. He's ready for the wheel. Yeah. <laughs> Not yet. Okay, so when you come round to this side of the wheel, you want to be as close as possible. Okay. So you want to sit like this, and then you have the support of your arms. So you can tuck mm -hmm. them in at your hips here, or you can okay. put them down onto the wheel, and that gives you all the strength from up in your shoulders. Yep. And the speed for your pedal is just down on the right hand side. Okay. So you can use your heel of your foot to bring the speed up. Mm -hmm. So, like this. And the toe of your foot to bring the speed down. So it's opposite from a car. <laughs> do you want to do it, Luther? You do it with your press. Yay! <laughs> Spinning! Spinning! <gasps> oh. <laughs> so I'm going to stop the wheel and add a touch of water. So this will help the clay stick on. And then I'm going to throw the clay down as central as I can. So I'm going to throw it now. What are you aiming? You don't have to aim because we can use the, the, the rings on the wheel yeah. to push it into position okay. like this. So now I'm going to go full speed. Okay. And it's going to be full speed for all of it except for when you build the walls up. Mm. And these are quite big bits of clay so you've got a challenge. Thanks, Leah. I've never done this before, you know. I'm going to do it ends. So you need loads of water as well. So when, when we swap, I'll hold it for you and just loads. I'm going to use this hand here, so my right one, and I'm going to push in on the side. And the other hand, I'm going to push down on top. Okay. And this is to centre the clay. Okay. So you need to do this before you start, and then you have a straight pot, or a straight ish. Okay. So we're pushing now. So in at the side, and down on top. So what you want is for the clay to spin with the wheel, rather than to be completely wobbling everywhere. So your hands should be steady, and you need to use all your muscles from up here. So you don't have to be quite strong to do this. It does require a lot of strength. Yeah, it does. Some people your whole body that they're like, almost. yeah, some people like really feel quite tense after it and sore. Some people work out as well. Yes, <laughs> it's a two for one. Mm -hmm. Okay, so when your clay is centered, you're then going to make a hole in the middle. So that's the beginning of your pot. And again, more water. So I'm going to use my thumb, either hand's fine. And I'm going to rest my hand here for support and then just Drill down about halfway, ah. so you're pushing down into the clay. This so, looks so therapeutic, by the way. It is. Yeah, it is. You you believe in like kind of like you've had a workout and also like up in the clouds. <laughs> <laughs> you had you had like relaxing music on. Yeah. As well. So now you can pop both thumbs in, and we're gonna whiten your pot. Okay. So this would be good if you're making a mug because you want it to be. So one thumb to thumbs begin with, and then get both thumbs in. Yes. Right. So I'm going to rest both my hands at the side now, mm -hmm. and then I'm going to put two thumbs in, and with stiff arms I'm going to pull the clay apart. So, nice wow. and controlled, like that. And now we can start to build the walls up. So for this we're going to slow the speed down, so with okay. the pedal here I'm just going to push forward towards you, mm -hmm. and bring the speed down a little bit. So why do you have to do this at a slower speed for the walls? Just for more control. So when you get taller, gravity kind of takes the clay outwards mm -hmm. when it spins. So if it's going fast, it's going to come out quicker. Right. So you just have more control and you can keep it cylindrical. Yeah. If you go I've too high, I've, I've got an idea. I think that's mine's going to turn out. I can picture mine just going everywhere. <laughs> a plate. It's going to be a plate. <laughs> a plate. Nah, we'll go for a cylinder. It'll be okay. Are you helping out there? Thanks, Lisa. Are you doing the pedal? <laughs> Thank you, Lisa. You just like the sounds it's making on the metal. <laughs> Perfect. 
because this is a right-handed wheel. Good. So it's perfect. Lisa, good job. <laughs> Thank you, Luther. Good, good job. job. You want to put your hands in the help, Leah? That's it. Oh. There you go. Thank you. So we're gonna have one hand in for support. So your left hand and your right hand is going to do all of the work. So you're going to push with this one and raise your hands all the way up to the top. <laughs> Thank you, Luther. Luther, good boy. Wow. Wow, it's going fast. It's going fast. Spinning. Spinning, spinning, spinning. You put lovely sponge Yay, in your pot. Sponge action now. <laughs> Thank you. So when your pot's spinning, you want to just close it in a little bit because if you don't, it does become wider and wider. So just every now and then, just give it a push with both of your hands and then you can you can build it up again. You're going to pop it in? Yay! <laughs> <laughs> just the normal technique, having a sponge yeah. in the middle. Yeah! It's a new technique. I think um, we'll call it the Luther. <laughs> so I'm going to bring one of the tools into play now. Luther's already, one of the steps is to soak the water out from the inside. So you've just done that for us. Okay, Thank that you. one step ahead of the game. <laughs> yes! So I'm going to take my wooden tool here and with the flat end, we can trim away some of that excess clay mm -hmm. and it'll make it easier to cut from the wheel. So I'll take that little sponge out and then all you're doing is trimming that clay away with the flat oh. edge here. <laughs> it's a masterpiece. There we go. Do you want to touch it, Luther? Have a go, Luther. Luther, you can have a go. You want to go sit with Leah and have a go? Go sit with Leah. Have a go.
get her two, two thumbs in. <laughs> this is where I'm going to go. Can you do this? Yeah, first? yeah. Dry, and then as soon as it's dry, we'll get it in the kiln for you. 
fun. And then we'll get it get it back to you. Well, Leah, yes, thanks so much for having us in today. You're very We've welcome. had a fantastic time and so has Luther. He is going home for a bath and to get cleaned up. But we always finish by saying, time is up, we have to go. I hope you've had fun and enjoyed the show. See you next time to say the rhyme and spin again for more Showtime!